What makes a great fighter jet? Is it stealth, speed, advanced weaponry, or is it cost effectiveness and versatility? In the world of modern military aviation, two jets stand out for very different reasons. The JAWS 39 Gripen, Sweden's agile and cost-efficient warrior, and the F-35 Lightning II, America's stealthy and technologically dominant powerhouse. One is a 4.5 generation fighter, designed for high maneuverability, rapid turnaround, and affordability. The other is a fifth generation stealth aircraft, built to dominate the skies with advanced sensors and electronic warfare. Both have strengths, both have weaknesses, but which one truly excels where it matters most? Today, we put them head to head to determine which fighter jet packs the bigger punch for modern warfare. But before getting to the main discussion, let's take a look at the overview of the both fighters. The Jazz 39 Gripen is a testament to efficient and versatile fighter design. Developed by Saab in the late 20th century, it was designed to replace Sweden's aging fleet while prioritizing multi-role capabilities, cost-effectiveness, and rapid deployment. Its lightweight canard delta wing configuration enhances maneuverability, making it highly agile in air combat. This adaptability allows it to perform air-to-air -air combat, ground attack, and reconnaissance missions, making it a true multi-role aircraft. The latest variant, the Gripen EF, brings cutting-edge avionics, a more powerful engine, and an advanced electronic warfare suite, keeping it competitive in modern air combat. A key upcoming upgrade is Sweden's plan to arm the Gripen with the Taurus KEPD 350 cruise missile, a long-range precision strike weapon with a range exceeding 500 kilometers. Once integrated by 2028, this will significantly boost the Gripen's ability to neutralize fortified enemy targets from standoff distances. But how does it compare to the F-35? The F-35 Lightning II represents a major leap in stealth and multi-role fighter technology. Developed under the Joint Strike Fighter program, it was designed to provide a common platform for various branches of the U.S. military and allied nations. One of its most defining features is its stealth technology, which allows it to evade radar detection and penetrate heavily defended airspace undetected. Beyond stealth, the F-35 boasts advanced avionics, including sensor fusion and network-centric warfare capabilities, giving pilots unmatched situational awareness and the ability to share real-time battlefield data with other assets. The fighter comes in three primary variants, each tailored for different operational needs. The F-35A, designed for conventional takeoff and landing. The F-35B, capable of short takeoff and vertical landing for use on amphibious assault ships, and the F-35C, optimized for carrier-based operations with a larger wingspan and reinforced landing gear. Now let's compare them head to head. When it comes to speed, the Gripen holds the edge with a top speed of Mach 2, making it faster and more agile than the F-35 which maxes out at Mach 1.6. Its lightweight canard delta wing design enhances maneuverability, making it an excellent choice for dogfighting. The F-35, while slower, takes a different approach. It leverages stealth and sensor fusion to dominate beyond visual range engagements, allowing it to strike before being detected. But speed isn't everything. Range and firepower matter too. The F-35 outperforms the Gripen in endurance, boasting a combat range of 2,200 kilometers compared to the Gripen's 1,500 kilometers. It also carries a heavier payload, up to 18,000 pounds of weapons, surpassing the Gripen's 13,000 pounds. However, Sweden is leveling the playing field by integrating the Taurus KEPD-350 cruise missile, a 
precision strike weapon with a range of over 500 kilometers. By 2028, this upgrade will significantly enhance the Gripen's long-range strike capabilities. Of course, a modern fighter jet is nothing without stealth, and that's where the F-35 truly excels. Its low radar cross-section and internal weapons bays make it nearly invisible to enemy detection. The Gripen, on the other hand, lacks stealth shaping, but it compensates with a powerful electronic warfare suite Using gallium nitride technology, it can jam enemy radars, disrupt missile guidance, and electronically evade detection. While the F-35 relies on stealth to survive, the Grip encounters with electronic warfare, making it highly effective in contested airspace. When it comes to operational flexibility, the Grip is built for maximum versatility. It can take off and land on short or improvised runways, including highways and remote airstrips, giving it a major advantage in decentralized operations. Its rugged design and quick turnaround time enable high sortie rates, making it an ideal choice for nations with limited infrastructure. The F-35, in contrast, requires well-maintained air bases to perform at its best. Its maintenance-intensive nature and longer servicing times can limit the number of missions it can fly in a given period. Cost is another key factor. The Gripen E is significantly more affordable, with a unit cost of around $85 million. The F-35A, while more advanced, comes at a higher price, around $100 million per unit. This stark difference makes the Gripen a more budget-friendly option for nations looking to balance performance with affordability. In terms of combat capabilities, the Gripen E integrates the Meteor missile, offering superior air-to-air -air combat performance, along with a gallium nitride-based electronic warfare suite that enhances survivability in high-threat environments. Sweden is also preparing to equip the Gripen with the Taurus KE PD-350 missile by 2028, adding long-range precision strike capabilities that will significantly boost its lethality. The F-35, on the other hand, excels in networked warfare. It features cutting-edge radar systems, sensor fusion, and advanced data-sharing capabilities, allowing it to coordinate seamlessly with allied forces and maintain a dominant situational awareness over the battlefield. On the global stage, the F-35 has been widely adopted, with over 1,000 units delivered across 17 countries, making it the most widely used fifth-generation fighter. The Gripen, though not as extensively exported, is operated by Sweden, Brazil, Thailand, and Hungary, and remains a strong contender for Air Forces prioritizing affordability, adaptability, and multi-role effectiveness. So, which fighter jet do you think is better? That's all for today. Thanks for watching.